Alright, so what is up y'all? It's Legendary EA back here for another rebuild and today I will be doing a historic rebuild. We will be rebuilding the 2007 to 2008 Houston Rockets. Now obviously I did take out the actual Rockets so the 2016 Rockets are not in, in the game mode. They are replaced with the 2007 Rockets. So no James Harden, no Eric Gordon, no any of that. But we are rebuilding them in 2016 in real life. We are doing this. So let's see what, what we can do. We got t Mac and we got Yao Ming. Now they are going to be free agents at the end of this season. And yeah, everybody's pretty much a free agent. So we're pretty much going to have to rebuild this team from scratch. We do got to see Francis on this team, I see. It was 30 years old. But let's look at our lineup for right now. So we're going to be running with, with this lineup. Bobby Jackson, t Mac, Shane Battier, Carl Landry, and yo, Yao Ming, so this is not even a bad team at all. But let's see how this team does. We are just going to be simming through this season just, just to see where, where we can start. But if you guys want to see another one of these rebuilds, make sure to go ahead and get 300, yeah, 300 likes on this video. And I know that you guys can do it because you guys are the best fans on the tube, on YouTube, y'all. And other than that, y'all, let me know which other rebuilds you guys want to see. If you guys want to see some of these historic teams like me rebuilding 2010 Big 3, uh 1994 magic with Shaq and Penny just let me know let me know in the comment section below and also before I even get done make sure to go ahead and subscribe if you guys are new but you know what y'all let's get straight into this re but let's get it and at the end of season number one LeBron is the MVP yo buddy healed wins rookie of the I've never seen that but he did put up some great numbers seven 18 points a game, 4 assists doing his thing 39% from the three yo I, I, that, that's that kind of shocks me I ain't gonna lie and everything else is pretty much the same except Eric, bro, new shit is popping up because Aaron Gordon is most improved player. Tyron Lewis coach of the year, of course. And did we get any, okay, well, T-Mac has to make one, one of these. Does he? So we get nobody from the Rockets on any of these teams. But there's always time for improvement. Okay, uh, yeah, I'm guessing Ben Simmons didn't play because he was injured. But we did finish out as a sixth seed. Let's see who was in front of us. Obviously going to say San Antonio. Portland Clippers okay so we were on the edge not making this out but let's check out our stats bro nobody these they weren't doing anything good now it makes sense and Yao Ming is out great so obviously we aren't gonna win Yao Ming didn't lead us in scoring didn't even get dealt he didn't even average double digits come on fam come on fam but you know what let's just go ahead and let's sim through these playoffs I, I don't think that we're gonna make it out of round one but we're just gonna find out I don't think it's gonna happen because we're playing the Trailblazers and hold up, hold up. We actually advanced to round number two. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, oh hmm. T Mac must be putting up god godly numbers. Uh, let's see how much he's actually averaging in, in the playoffs. Ooh, it's, he's not even doing all that. But we got point guards for days on this squad. So the Phoenix Suns, we might be able to beat them too. We should be able to if we if we beat Portland. And we go ahead and we advance to the conference finals. Talk about an easy road as Portland sweeps San Antonio. So now up against the Golden State Warriors, I yeah, I don't think that this is going to happen. But hold up. We took them to game seven. I don't even know how that happened, bro. We took them to game seven, and Golden State goes ahead, and they win the championship. Steph Curry is your finals MVP. But, yo, in, it, after year two, we got to go ahead, and we got to make some moves. Yo, all those guys got hurt, and that that, that, that can't happen again, homie. That cannot happen again. So we're going to have to go ahead and make some moves. And let's see what we can do. Let's see the NBA the same, though. Let's not change nothing. Let's not change anything, but let's see which draft pick we get, and let's see if we can just, you know, make this team contenders. So I really do like this trade right here. We'll we'll be sending our 22nd pick, a second round pick, and Steve Novak over to the Warriors for two first round pick. Even though it's the Warriors, it's still a first round pick. There's no other way around that. We got 80 million dollars in cap room. We should be able to sign both of our guys back. Oh, I don't want to. Ah, why did I enter the NBA draft? So these are my free A. Oh. <laughs> Bro, I'm, I'm gonna have to give T Mac all this. Okay. I uh, fine. $30 million. 30 mil. Yao Ming. Dang. These guys, these are okay. Yao Ming might. You know what? I'm, I'll, I won't trade him. I'll, since he's only 28, anyways. Shame. Bro, everybody's a free agent on this team. I better have bird rights on them. I don't even have bird rights on them. Oh my freaking goodness. Oh my. Dude, you would think that I, I would have bird rights. Dang. This, this honestly sucks. I do still wanna get. I wanna try to get Durant. So let's see. The Rockets, we are the number one option. Maybe Steph Curry. How are you going to decline my offer? So we, bruh. So I can bring in Tracy and KD. 
And then I, w I would have to pass on Yao Ming, though. Ah, ah, I, I, I can't say no to that offer, fam. I, I just can't do it. How much money do, do we have left, though? We got 18 mil. How much can I offer Yao Ming? I'll take a Wizards first round pick. And I can turn around and flip Mahini, right? Right? I, I better be able to. Ooh, second round pick. That sounds like a... Oh, first round pick from the Nuggets bet. Thank you, guys. How much money do, do we have now in cap? $24 million. I need, I, I need two mil more. Steve Francis, homie. Uh... Ooh, you're gonna have to go. I'll, I'll take a first round pick from the Pistons though. So we should have enough to sign Yao Ming. Yeah, we got 28 mil. So we should have enough to sign Yao, right? There we go. So we get Yao Ming back. There we go. So now we got a big three of KD, Tracy, and Yao Ming. So now we need to find some other players. Because right now we are taking a lot of L's in free agency. We don't even have a bench. So hopping into player progression, Yao Ming does get worse, but he's still an 86 overall. Yo, Carl Landry is improving, huh? Because he's, he's only 25. So, I like that. Shane Batty is getting... Woo, we, got, we got to make moves. I'm not going to front. We got to make some moves. So, for season number two, this is our starting lineup. TJ McConnell, Tracy McGrady, Kevin Durant, and Luis Scola with Yao Ming, yo. Changes have got to be made. I'm, there's there's no other way to put it. Changes have got to be made. Trace Scola and two first-round picks. So starting this thing off, we will be trading away Luis Scola, Andrew Bogey, and a first round pick in return for Taj Gibson and Bobby Porters, just to help us off off of our bench. So let's look at it right now. We gotta, we still need a, we still need a, we need a point guard badly. Like there's no other way of putting that. We need a point guard badly. Uh, we are killing it in the power forward position, so I, I can't trade away Taj Gibson. So let's see what I can get for Taj Gibson in two first round picks. Come on, all these first round picks for one dude. All right, so. We do get Martell Folks. Let's start that point guard. I still want to, I still make that power forward position a little bit better. And I'll, I still want to increase our bench depth. So let's see if we can make a trade for a better power forward. So we will be doing this trade, sending Brian Roberts and two first round picks over to the Brooklyn Nets for Sean Kilpatrick and a first round pick. Yo, Sean Kilpatrick is pretty nice to come off of, of our bench. So that's cool right there. I still want to get a better power forward, but I, I low key do not know who to get. So. Dang, like nobody is trying to make trades. So how about this, Bobby Portis? Two first round picks. Come on, be some fire. How about this? All right, so we get Joel Embiid on the squad. We can play him at power forward. His overall should go up because he can actually kind of shoot, and it does. So I, I I I mess with this lineup. So this will be our lineup for season number two. It's gonna be Markel Folks, Tracy McGrady, KD. Joel Embiid and Yao Ming. So we got a little Twin Towers thing going on. We got a 7-foot power forward. And we got a 7-6 center. And off the bench, we got Sean Kilpatrick, Bobby Portis, Boban Marjanovic, Shane Battier, and Andre Roberson. I'm not really feeling it, but I guess I'll, I'll take this trade for Mo Will and uh, Norris Cole. So same lineup, same thing. Nine-man rotation. I like my starters playing a lot. So this is the lineup that we will be running with. Hopefully, it, it gets the job done and this team is hella cold. We're going to have to sit back and find out, y'all. Let's see what this team can do at the end of season number two. But I definitely think that this team can win a championship. Let's look at all the depth that we got. And at the end of season number two, LeBron is the MVP. Dennis Smith is rookie of the year. Doing his thing there. Spencer Hall is a sixth man. You've never seen that before. Chris Karis LeVert is most improved player. And coach the year goes to our coach, Oliver Cooper, because we have the best record in the NBA, 68 and 14. And, you know, the team was, we, we was already killing this, so we have to have somebody on, on one of these teams. We have to have somebody. Bruh, how are we not getting anybody on any of these teams? I'm, 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 I'm not getting it. I'm not getting it at all. Well, Markel Fultz didn't make all rookie first team, but, geez, y'all, we have the best record in the NBA. So let's see. Golden State was right behind us by five games, and yeah, so were the so were the Cavaliers. So let's see how good our team is in scoring. Kevin Durant averaged 25 points a game, eight rebounds, seven assists, two steals. Markel Fox was our second leading scorer. Yo, Tracy McGrady ain't putting up no numbers. He's not putting up, any, and he's shooting a good ass percentage. He's shooting 54% from the field. KD with 50. He's not putting up any type of numbers. Like our backup shooting guard was doing better. So that's something to take a look at. But let's see if we can go ahead and win this championship. I definitely think that we can. This team kills it. 
I'm not gonna front. This team absolutely killed it. And let's see what we can do in round one versus the Denver Nuggets. Yeah, we should sweep this team. I, I, at least I hope we should. And we don't. We actually go ahead and win a six up against the Los Angeles Clippers. We all know about the Clippers, how they cannot make it past round two. And I'm sure it's gonna happen again. And Chris Paul has a broken left hand. Which means Austin Rivers with that $12 million contract is gonna buy a lot for him, huh? Isn't that what it means? Nope, because we went in five. So Golden State in round number three, the conference, the conference finals, y'all. Can we win the West? We might be able to, but ooh, this team's still looking good. Now we did snag Kevin Durant from them, but they still got Steph Curry, Draymond, and Clay. Our bench is, in my opinion, and it's better. But let's see what we can do. I'm, I'm taking this game by game. Whoever comes out of the East, I, I, I hope it's, I hope it's the Hornets. I want an easy championship. Let's see. We take game one. We take game two. They take game three. Oh, we. I'm not going to get happy because know why? The last time Kevin Durant was up 3 1. The Warriors are heading back to the NBA Finals at seven, winning three consecutive high stakes games to take this series. You were up 3 1, and then you lost to the Warriors. <laughs> He blew it. So we do go ahead and win. Unfortunately, we're taking on the Cavs. Ah, please let Kyrie be injured. Let Kyrie be injured. Let Kyrie be injured. Is he injured? He's good. He's more than good, actually. And LeBron is still a 97. He can't shoot that three. So let's go ahead and let's see what we can do. Our team, bro, we, we got to win this championship, man. We got to win this championship. I mean, who's taking on these Twin Towers, homie? Who's taking on these twin towers? Jo jo Joel Embiid averaged 13 points a game, eight rebounds, two blocks. Yao Ming, 13 points, 10 rebounds, almost three blocks a game. So, yo, don't come inside Tristan Thompson. But they do take game one. They take game two. Oh, my goodness, fam. We. Oh, I'm, I'm getting kind of scared. I'm getting scared. They they kill us in that first quarter, though. Hold on. We, oh, snap. We might be able to come. No. we Can, can we come back, though? Yeah, I don't think it's going to happen because we lose in five. One more season. Let's see what we can do. Let's hope that we can go ahead and win the championship. And I'll see you guys in free agency. And hopefully, Joel Embiid, we got him on a qualifying offer. Same thing with Boban. So hopefully, nobody tries to pick them up. We're going to offer Sean Kilpatrick because, yeah, he did really good for us off the bench. So I do want to bring him back. Uh, so let's see, man. Let's just see. We, we just got to wait and see how we do. In free agency, PG is there. Obviously, we can't get any of these guys. Oh, we might be able to get Melo, though. We might be able to get Melo for the low low. And Lamarcus Aldridge for the low low. Okay. All these old guys want to come in and win a ring. Oh, let, oh, oh. I'm I'm cool with that. I'm so cool with that. All right. Who do we have bird rights on? Any old people want to? Dirt. Come win a ring with us. Uh, bro, if we pull this off, I'm done. If we pull this off. We get all these old people who are actually still good on these low contracts. So we sign Lamarcus Aldridge. We don't we don't get dirt, but it's cool. Tony Allen accepted another offer. It's whatever. Uh, who else did was on our team that we want to get though? Day two, bruh. Fuck no. We gotta be able to get. We gotta be able to get to get Melo. Come on, fam. Come on. You don't even need Lamarcus. Come on. How much how much in debt are we? Negative seven. Bro, come on. Don't do this. I'm gonna go ahead and take Ivan Rab. Or, yeah, I Ivan Rab is the best pick for this. This sucks, man. This, we can't get Melo. Oh, my. We really cannot get Carmelo Anthony. We really cannot get Carmelo Anthony. Melo doesn't even want to come here. Bro, Melo, you suck ass, dude. Screw, man, screw Melo. So, we did miss out on Melo, but we were able to pick up everybody else. Hold up. Where is... All right, I was tripping. I was like, where the hell is MB at? So we do get LaMarcus Aldridge on the team for the low low, probably starting a power forward for us, so which means Joel Embiid will be coming off the bench, but he's still going to be good. So I do want to make some trades here. We almost got Carmelo Anthony, and that would help us out so much. But let's see what we can do in season number two. Yo, we definitely are going to win a championship this year. So this looks like it will be our starting line of first season number three. Markel Folk, Tracy McGrady, KD, LaMarcus, and Yao Ming with Joel Embiid as our sixth man. Now, I do want to test out what I can get for Ivan Rab and two, maybe two first round picks. So I really do like this trade 
I mean, L Lamarcus Aldridge is a beast. This is honestly like a really tough decision because he's cold. He's super cold, and we still have jo we, we would still have uh, Joel Embiid coming off the bench as our backup power forward. But if we can improve there and improve at point guard, then we would have Mar then we would have Markel Folks coming off the bench too. And Larry Nance is still a good solid backup. He can shoot mid range a little bit, not as good as Lamarcus Aldridge, but he's better on defense than Lamarcus. He's obviously more athletic. Potential is a B plus. His his is a B plus too, huh? His is an A minus, but he's 33. This is 25. I think this is a trade that we're gonna have to take. Did throw in anything else? No. All right. I guess we're gonna take this. Or this this original trade. We could have got Devin Booker, but it's just not been worth it. So we're gonna be taking this trade, trading away Lamarcus Aldridge, two first round picks, Shane Battier in return for deloading and Larry Nance, and I do it. And I hope it was the right decision, but we're going to have to sit back and find out. So right now, our starting lineup for season number two is in the, for season number three, is going to be deloading Tracy McGrady, KD, Joel Embiid, Yao Ming, and off the bench, it's going to be Larry Nance, Markel Folks, Sean Kilpatrick, Ivan Rabb, Boban, and all these guys right here. So now that we have that done, I can't trade away Ivan Rabb. That'd probably be like our last move of the season. And let's just see what, what we can get for him. And I am definitely willing to make this move. Uh, yeah, I'm I'm definitely willing to make this move. Is he good at? Yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna be trading Ivan Rab, a second round pick, and Norris Cole in return for Patty Mills and a first round. Just, just because Patty Mills is a great backup, he'll be a great third stringer too. So other than that, I think that we are good on all that. Uh, our bench is playing a lot. I don't really like that Rick Carlisle. Hopefully this team can go ahead and win a championship. This is line that we will be running with. I do want to play him a little bit more so let's see how this team can do in season number three like i said before this is our starting lineup and i think that we have a chance to be a really good team let's see let's see i mean i, I don't think any team can even mess with us and at the end of season number three lebron once again is the mvp and let's see if anything else changed everything's pretty much the same and once again we do have coach of the year rick carlisle we went 69 and 13 this team was on a complete tear best record in the NBA, and of course, he is coach of the year. We have to have people on in this year. Kevin Durant is all NBA first team. Anything? De Dennis Smith? Whoa, okay. And that's it, bro. We, we, we stay in ho, but it's really whatever. Our team was cold. That's all I can say. We were the first seed, obviously. And let's see which teams were behind us. The Pelicans were the second seed. They were 15 years behind us. And Golden State was 19 years behind us. And yeah, we were pretty much killing it in the West. But let's look, let's look at our team stats real, real quick. Kevin Durant did lead us in scoring. Kevin Durant did lead us in scoring, averaging 26 points a game, nine rebounds, six assists, doing his thing. And then it was D'Angelo Russell, and it seems like Trace McGrady just, I don't know, he he just he just, he just not doing good. But look at this man. Our team is still balling out of control. Let's see how Mark Hill folks did off the bench. Let's see how we did off the bench. He put up 12 off the bench, so he, yo, he's still doing his thing, even though he's a backup now. But let's see. I think that we could definitely crush everybody that we play. San, San Antonio is the AC, but I wouldn't put it past them because, yo, hold up. They take us to game seven. Oh, my, fr bro. I'm, no, no, no. We're not losing to them. We're not losing to San Antonio in round one. We're not doing, bro. We dropped 50 points in the first quarter. We dropped 50. In, okay, there, there, there's no coming back from that. There's no coming back. And we go ahead and we advance to round two versus the LA Clippers. Just like I said last year, guys, we are we already know about them. They do not make it past round number two. And I think it's going to happen again. Let's see. Let's go ahead and let's see. Man, that was crazy. But let's see. I'm, no, I'm simming the, the entire round. I'm not afraid of them. And we go ahead and we sweep them. Up against Golden State in round number three. The conference finals and we beat them last year. I think that we can do it again because this team is definitely better. They got Kylo Quinn starting. Draymond is probably hurt, huh? Draymond's hurt. This is a dub. This is a dub. They take game one though. We take game two. They take game three. Okay. It's getting kind of scary. It's getting it's getting really scary actually. It's getting really scary. all right. Put T Mac back in that lineup. It's, it's, it's getting scary out here. We, we gotta win two in a row. Come okay, we are doing it. We're killing them, and we forced a game seven. And of course, Cleveland sweeps the Nets. I don't know how they made it there, but it's game seven. We're, we're playing at home, so we got to get this dub. Come on, y'all. Come on, y'all. That's that's what I'm talking about. And we go ahead and we advance to the NBA Finals for the second year in a row. Last year we lost, 
but we're getting our match. We're getting our rematch against Cleveland. Kevin Durant is coming for vengeance, and we will finally, maybe we'll finally be able to get, maybe we'll finally be able to get T Mac a ring, and Yao Ming. That would be great. Let's see if we can do it. Oh yeah, and, and of course Kevin Durant. But let's see, because we take game one, we take game two. Oh, LeBron, are you about to get swept? Are you about to get swept? And he does as the Houston Rockets win their first championship since 1994. Kevin Durant is our finals MVP. But anyways, I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Like I said before, y'all, let's get 300 likes for another one of these types of rebuilds. And this is our final roster. We had Kevin Durant, Tracy McGrady, Yao Ming, DeAndre Russell, Joel Embiid, Larry Dash Jr., Markel Folks, Boban Marjanovic, Patty Mills, Sean Kilpatrick, Andre Roberson, TJ McConnell, Aaron Brooks, Marvin Williams. So our team was definitely the best team in the NBA. But I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Like I said before, y'all, if you guys are not subscribed, what are you doing? Hop on Team EA, join the family, and hit that subscribe button. And other than that, y'all, make sure to follow me on Twitter at LegendaryEA2. And it's your boy, Legendary EA. Hope you guys enjoy this rebuild. And until next time, y'all, I'm out. Peace.